Hey VC, uh, this is Luke with Hot Wax and Cool Vinyl. Uh, welcome back. A very, very brief, brief video today. Um, I got this idea from uh, Metal Ron, Ron Haggerty's channel. Ron had done a, a very brief video the other day um, for Trade and BCLT, and it got me thinking. Um, I have a, a lot of doubles and triples and albums that I just don't really want. So um, subsequent to this, you'll see, um, I'll flip through them. And um, less for anything other than VCLT or trade, if you see anything like that, but more for VCLT. And let me explain why. I, I These are records that I'm going to wind up donating um, to either one of my local churches, uh, one of my local thrift stores, or the um, Historical Society record barn that I showed in the uh, one of the contest entries. Um, I would just as soon see it go into someone's hands who wants this record or, or needs this record or, or wants to explore a new a new sound. A lot of these records are fusion, uh, Pat Metheny, Clue, and stuff like that. Um, most of them are pretty common, but if it's missing from your collection or you want an upgrade copy or whatever, please just send me a quick message. Um, you can send it to me here on YouTube. You can leave a comment down below. Uh, I'm also part of the YouTube vinyl community on Facebook, that group. So if you're part of that group and you want to just send me a message, message me through Facebook, that's fine too. Um, it's uh, pretty straightforward. Like I said, I, I these are not these records. I'm going to wind up giving away. Um, so if I'm going to give them away to my local church, before I do that, if you guys want a copy of one or need an upgrade copy or you're like, hey, you know, I don't have any Pat Metheny or I've, never, I've heard of them, but I don't have any stuff, just shoot me a message, I'll send it to you. Um, I, I have no qualms with that whatsoever. So uh, have a great rest of your week. Today is Thursday. Um, so hopefully you're having a great day. If not, um, you'll have a great day tomorrow. Um, hopefully you'll uh, find something uh, record-wise that you like. Um, please leave me a comment and I'll speak to you soon. Have a great night all. We'll talk to you later. Okay, so um, this is what uh, the records I had mentioned before. Um, there's three bins. Um, so let's go flip through them really fast. Uh, a lot of this stuff is some early fusion, mid-80s fusion. Um, and if there's anything in particular, you you know, you say, hey, you know what, I like that, or... And a lot of this stuff is common. Some of this but it's some cool stuff. So if you want to explore some new genres of, of fusion and stuff, please let me know. Um, this is actually pretty legit. The, the cover shot, but um, Kelly and Montgomery did a really nice job with that album. Um, so. Right, who couldn't use a little Petula Clark in their collection? Some CDB. James Taylor. Um, most of these are very good, very good. Plus, some are good. Um, here's a nice copy of Spyro Gyra. If anybody really wants to dig some, some fusion, I don't think you can get... I think Spyro Jar is the definition of, of fusion. Yeah, you have to excuse. I pack them, and when I store my doubles, I do tend to pack them in a little tighter. 
Uh, when I do the next bucket, I'll probably just pull some out and then it'll be a little easier to show them. I'm being quite serious. Don't hesitate to just shoot me a message and saying, hey, I'm interested in that. Can you send it to me? Um, I would rather give it to you guys than uh, the goodwill or things like that. Okay, I'm just going to do this real fast because it's a little easier to sort through this way. So we're getting close to buying season again for me up here on the island and I want to get rid of some of this excess uh, so I can get some more. At Cosmos Factory cover shop, but the record's pretty good. And who can't use 18 copies of Simon and Garfunkel, right? Pull these out so we can get a little better on this. Sorry guys, it's just... Okay, yeah, we have some extras real fast up here. Uh, this is some Fusion Frampton. Not quite sure. Um, if anybody's a Genesis fan, you already have it, Bill. <laughs> You've got like five copies of, of Seconds Out. Um, And a couple of Pat Matheny's. And some Cool for Cats. And... Okay, so that's it.